Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a nearly unlimitless number of WordPress themes uh, with a program called Artister that only costs $50. I never ever talk about products that cost anything, but in this case I think they're absolutely amazing. This program is amazing. It's worth its weight in gold. $50, bucks, $49.95. This is the program Artister. And I'm going to show you real quickly how, how easy it is to throw up together on WordPress. You'll see when you open up the program that it loads. This is on a Mac. I actually normally use the PC version because supposedly the Mac version is buggy, but I never had a problem with either one of them. Now you can see here, if you actually clicked on Suggest Design, it's just going to randomly create you a bunch of new designs. Well, I like to just jump right into it. You can see here, if we're clicking on Layout, and let's say I want what's called a header on top here with a menu underneath, I just click here. Header, menu, and it automatically creates it. If I want this to be a setup in regards to columns with a big one on the left and one on the right, which is the most common, I just click on that. If I want to change my background, click on image and texture. It gives you a whole bunch of different options in regards to backgrounds and so forth. And if you want to apply it, you just click there. I'm going through this really quick so I can cover everything in this one uh, tutorial and get in under the 10 minute. So let's say I made that as my background. I decide I don't want these bubbles over here. Click on glare, got rid of them. I could put all kinds of different shapes and so forth in here. And if you just rest your mouse over top, you'll be able to see what they would look like. Let's say in this situation, that's what I want as a glare. I'm just going through this real quickly. Click on gradient whole bunch of different gradients that are available to you. Let's say I want to go from dark to light. Click on it. And want to change the background color to something that would work look out look a little bit better for me. You can see just how simple this is to do. Click on sheet. That's this whole entire page here. Want to add a glow. Just click on that. You can see a glow was added. No border. If I wanted to add a border. It's just as simple. It automatically generates everything for you. If you want to throw a different type of shadow on it, just click on that. You can see, automatically updated. I could change my padding. Set up now to currently have no padding. Let's say I wanted to add some. Click on that. And you see how everything shrunk in from the outside of the overall web page? Can set it up so that I uh, have transparency on the website just by doing that. And now you can see the background actually shows through. But that's not really good form, so we're going to get rid of that. And there's just tons of things you can mess with. This header is way too big. Want to see how hard it is to change that? Click on that. If you didn't see, all I did to change the type, the height of the header, is to go in here and change this. See how it changed? Now let's say I want my overall width to be 1000. Automatically did it. Now I want to go in here. I can actually throw in my own uh, photograph in here if I wanted to do that. Don't want to. Let's say I wanted to change the overall effect. Put something. You can see all these effects that are available to you. I mean, it's really amazing. Um, just throw something in there. It's crazy just to do something. Or I can do a texture. So let's say in this situation, that's what I want to do. Come in here, maybe texture such as that. Automatically applies it. In here is where you would put your logo, any type of logo that you'd want to use. I have one pre-installed. There you see it. Now if I want to move this logo over here, just reach in here, grab it, throw it in, click OK. Here's my headline. I'm going to change the positioning on this. All I did was click on the position right here, grab it, move it over. I know this isn't the prettiest thing on earth. I'm actually just trying to do this really quickly. Now, let's say I wanted to change the overall styling of my menu. 
so many different options available. So I like that. I want to change, I could put any texture on here for a fill. Let's say I wanted to uh, make this a darker color. Say I wanted to change, uh, you see here's a, a drop down menu. Coloring options that are available to me. I mean, it's just literally, you just click. It's just so simple. Go into the article, I want everything to be left justified indented, outdented, if I wanted to change my line, my spacing between my characters, if I wanted to change the distance between these the lines of text to make them more legible, just click there, see, automatically works. I mean, it's just a really dynamic, nice program. And just to show you the different types of bullets that are available, I mean, a whole host of different bullets, um, different table styles, Blocks, what that refers to is this space over here. Let's say I wanted to do a more simplistic styling on the left. All I did was just clicked on that. Boom, automatically changed. And it automatically changed again. Change the header to the text, put an icon next to, change the icon to next, see, automatically changed. I want to change my button styling. I want to change my footer at the bottom of the page. If I wanted to put multiple different RSS feeds, if you don't know what RSS is, don't worry about that. So I just clicked on that, automatically updates. And then to export, all that you do, whoops, I want to do that. If you want to export this as a WordPress theme, just go down here. More than likely, you're going to want to export it as a zip archive, that way you can easily upload it on the, your theme website hit export, and you're ready. So that was a basic review of Artister uh, version 2, standard edition. Uh, the WordPress version costs $49.95, and there is a, a more substantial version, which I have not played around with, uh, and set up more for customer management uh, sites. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed Artister. And go you can go to artister.com and try it out for free. Thanks a bunch. Have a great day.